you been what you been thinking? You like it? I love it. They're doing amazing. <laughs> I hope I want to go to a game Friday. Yeah. Yeah, I want to. <laughs> I feel like there's a butt there though, right? I've never been to a baseball game. Whoa. I always watch, but I've never been to a baseball game. Wow. Ever? Never. Like not even like a minor league game? No. Never been to a baseball game. College game? Seriously. No. Not even like a game in South Carolina. Because they were good while you were there, Yeah, South Carolina was good when I was there, but never was able to go to a baseball game. I don't know why I've just never been to one. Like, you know, I always like the Braves, you know, since they was at Turner Field. But just never had a chance to go to a baseball game. So hopefully, hopefully Friday I can go to one. That's a good first game to have. Yeah, the World Series, right? Yeah. yeah. I mean, the regular season games, you just don't ever go to a regular season game, man, if that's going to be your first experience. I would have went. It's just I didn't have a chance to go. Well, no, I'm just saying, if you go, that don't ever go to a big experience. is so different. Really? Regular season, yeah, regular season game, and 181 of them. Yeah, but I mean, I haven't been to none. <laughs> <laughs> I guess we could ask you about football now. Um, I want to go back to that, that final drive uh, of the last game, and I know Matt was really commending you and CP about what y'all were able to do in the run game in those final, like, minute, knowing that y'all had a lot of time left on the clock. Can you kind of just walk us through – those last few runs and how important they were for that specific moment in the game? Um, yeah, in that moment of the game, uh, you're just trying to basically, you know, waste time to, you know, to get automatic coup back there for him to kick. But um, you don't want to score, uh, don't want to leave any time or any possibility for Miami to get the ball back. So we, I feel like we handled that situation great. I think we all equate Arthur with the run game. You probably – do you think of when you think of Arthur? Do you think the same thing? I mean, he's a he's a run first, or at least a big run guy. Yeah, I mean Arthur's he's he's out here. Arthur's calling great plays, uh, mixing it up. Uh, me CP makes. Sure, I mean, the ball is being spread out everywhere, so it's it's not just one person. So I mean, it's it's really nice to see. How far down the path are you to where your run game could be? What percentage are you to get to where you want to be in the run game overall? Oh, I I have no idea. <laughs> I'm not I'm not in charge of that. You know, I, like I said, I'm just out there to do whatever coach says. Whether, you know, if 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 I got to block all game, I will be blocking all game. You know, as long as we win, I don't care. How do you feel like you're running this Um, uh, I'm not doing as I'm I'm to my standard. I'm not doing as as good as I want to be. Um, but you know, it'll come. You know, it's a long season. Why, why do you feel like that, that's been the case? Uh, I, I mean, I don't know. It's, it's <laughs> probably me, you know. Uh, never been satisfied with, with where I am. So, I would say that. Yeah, how close are y'all to popping some big ones? And y'all watching on film, and y'all like, okay, this little bit here, this little bit there. Uh, you know, might have popped that in Oh, uh, we've been very close, man. We're we're making strides every game, and, and and you can see it. Uh, the guys up front and uh the running backs, we 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 feel it. Uh, we feel like it'll happen. Uh, but when it does, we just have to be ready for it. We can't be surprised. Like you said, it's you, is, there, is there something that like you've kind of brought when you've been watching from yourself, like, you know, maybe some scouting? Like, are there things that you're seeing that you're not maybe doing? Is it something else that's happening? It's, like you said, putting putting yourself in that position where you're not happy. Um, no, nah, it, mostly mostly it's just me. Um, you know, just I just have to be have to be better. How do you go about? Like, I'm, I'm just wondering how you try to go about doing things. Obviously, practice, uh, practicing hard, um, and just making sure I'm ready when the opportunity comes. Is it? Have you gone through this type of thing before, where you haven't been happy with how you've been running, or? Uh yeah, I have. Uh, early on in my career, um, all I had to do was just work harder. Was there are there things you can? I'm assuming that was in Seattle, right? Like, are there things you can take from that time in Seattle that can help you with this? Yeah, work harder. Yeah, like I said, uh, you know, practice harder. Uh, look at more film. Sunday mean anything to you, different to you because you were on Carolina last year, or is that at this point you just kind of like whatever? 
No, it, I mean it, it means a lot to us because it's a divisional game. So it's it's not just it's not a personal thing with me. Uh, it's a divisional game. That's something that you know we want bad. We want to you know you want to win those games. So that's how I'm looking at it. I know you say you work harder. Is there something else that you can see that's tangible? Like, are, are teams going to be paying more attention to your whole, like the holes that are opening up for you and the, when you do get the ball? I'm just, I'm just trying to understand beyond like work harder what what you might what you might be seeing. Um, I mean, you watch film, you you see. Uh, I mean. It's, it's hard to explain. Uh, you know, it, it takes everybody, you know. But, uh, you know, whatever does, you know, happen is on – relax, my guy. It's, you know, uh, I take everything responsibly on me. Do you have people telling you to relax? Like, is that part of it? No. This is what I tell myself. That's what you tell yourself. What is it like having a guy like CP on your team? Oh, my God, man. A guy like Cordell Patterson, I mean – He's a, a a great individual, you know, a guy who's who's fun and 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 great on and off the field. Um, overall, nice guy. Are you, are you surprised he's a running back though? Not really, not really surprised. Not really surprised he's a running back. I mean, uh, I I saw it in Chicago uh, with this guy. You know, he he was always upbeat, you know, and he could run so. You know, he can do it all. And he can pass. <laughs> do you think he has a future in the media? Cordell Patterson? Yeah. Oh, my God, yes. I mean, I feel like he, he needs his own reality TV show, if, if, if we want to be honest. I've been thinking about that. Wow. Too. Are you shocked that he likes as much country music as he does? Very, very shocked. Um, I, have, I haven't met a guy, I mean, I would not think that Cordell Patterson loves country music as much as he does. But as much as he listens to country music, he knows his stuff. I, I don't know if that came from Tennessee or maybe his sister.